What is up ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Now, as you can see behind me, there's a little bit of a monster truck behind me and it's got some pretty cool lights on it. You guys probably remember this thing about two weeks ago, I did a video where I went tackle shopping, fishing tackle shopping in that truck right there. And you guys should recognize, it's the old kicking their bass TV mobile. It's a pretty sick little truck. The video did great. We got almost 100,000 views on it. You guys just absolutely love it. So I'm actually in Atlanta, Georgia right now. I'm kind of wrapping up a little two day trip that I made up here. We did a ton of filming, me and Kicking Their Bass TV. He's actually busy right now prepping what's gonna be in today's video. We've been just killing it, guys. I mean, filming all type of cool content for you guys, collaboration, stuff that you guys wanna see. Although you guys wanted to see another tackle truck shopping video, you know, I just don't know if that's gonna be cool enough for today's video. So luckily for you guys, my good buddy Noah from Kicking Their Bass TV has decided to extend a little offer our way, the Lojo Fishing Fam's way. Behind that door, right behind me, the heavenly light that is coming out from behind my head is a private tackle store slash garage. And I say it's a store because it is a store. As much as that truck is a rolling tackle store, that place in there is a literal tackle store. I think he's in there right now messing around, kind of getting some stuff ready, maybe making it look good, maybe making it look bad. I don't really know, but uh, I'm excited. You guys are gonna be very excited to see this, I promise you. You're also gonna wanna watch this video very, very carefully. As you guys remember, in the rolling tackle truck video, there was a giveaway somewhere in there, but you're gonna have to watch the video. Sit back, relax, enjoy seeing this fishing garage. Let's all be jealous because none of us have anything like this. Let's see if he's ready. What up, dude? What's up, folks? A bunch of water just dumped off. <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> a bunch of water oh just dumped up. What's up, what's dude? On, man? man, what's going on? What's what's happening in this room right here, man? Jeez. Oh, let me turn off the light. Yeah. That's really bright. We wanted that to look cool, and then water just got dumped all over Noah's head from that door. So look at all this water that just fell off the dang sliding door. Good God. So yeah, man, this is your uh I mean fishing tackle man cave garage yes, sir. crazy building thing right here yeah man. completely private never really been seen before yeah, has it dude, I, I mean i mean it has and you know the older vlogs maybe five years ago yeah man, so it's it's been a while not this in is, a while we have a man do we have a banger for you guys dude <laughs> this is some crazy People i'm see, telling you i don't I'm know ready. if you guys know but i fish tournaments for a very long time, around True. 10 years. So this is this is my whole little tournament arsenal that you guys this, are gonna see. Good God. And it's it's a lot of stuff. This is probably what tournament anglers' garages look like though. Oh, no, it? seriously like, though. There's I'm, tons of stuff because everywhere. Because you fish so many bodies of water. You right. fish for you know, large mouth, small mouth, spotted bass. Exactly. You fish for the whole Shazam. So yeah. you, know, you need all different things for each scenario. Dude, this is crazy. I know the people are ready to dive in this. I'm gonna let you take over and kind of just give us a quick run through tour of everything. Right. And then we'll start breaking stuff down as we go through. Yes, Sound good? Let's do it. So as you guys can tell, we have a ton of tackle behind us. We're gonna be breaking yeah. a lot of it you down. You think? Look at, <laughs> dude, look, look at this. If this is all tackle, then we're in for quite a show today. Oh, it, it, yeah, it's all tackle. <laughs> dude, that's this, is, this is like some exclusive stuff, guys. This is stuff I don't show you know often. So, so you know, we got a bunch of big, Tupperware boxes right here. Before we even get that started, I have a few boxes on top that we're actually gonna take off. And I'm gonna yeah, show you some stuff in here. Pull those bad boys um, out. So here we go. It's a little jig box. Oh, I know box. you got a jig box. Oh, this is one. This I got five or six jig Dude. boxes, but <laughs> five or six. No, You're a jig guy man. for sure. I believe you. I mean I have this is one of the wackiest looking jigs. That is a wacky Skirt jig. Fell off. Some of these are older. Oh boy. Right there. This one you guys are gonna really love. Holy oh, cow. Oh boy. As you guys can tell, I, I use the label in my boxes, hard body swim baits. Hard bodies. And these are like these are some of them, you know. I, I wasn't ever Dude. big into swim baits. Glide baits galore. Oh, yeah, man. these are Holy some of those. Moly. Oh, those things are sexy. I believe this is the eye slide. If I, if yeah, I'm, I think it is. Eye slide. Yeah. Yep, that's <laughs> these it. are the eye slides right I there. Those are it. freaking killer. Got some bull shads in there as mm -hmm. well. Um, got some, you know, faster little swim baits like that. Those are killer on Lanier for some big spotted bass. No ice, no um, ice. Some, some bills. I could not tell you how many big fish I've caught on these things. Um, and yeah, just a big, you know, selection. Got some of those boy ducket bull shads. Just no a bunch ice. of different cool swim baits in there. Something about the excitement of hooking a big fish on a big swim bait. No doubt. It's just rewarding, you know what I mean? It's different, man. It's definitely different. What do we got here? Top order box. 
This is some some top Ooh, waters that I've had. We're talking. Um, Tell me you got a buzz bait in oh, here, dude. or just all like hard baits. I, Look at that! Dude, is that not the biggest frog you've <laughs> yes, ever seen? Yes! Oh life? my god! That's a mega frog, bro. That is amazing, That's guys. This thing, <laughs> this thing the is biggest massive. frog you've ever seen. That is dude. hilarious. Yeah, I'm, I That's bought that. Crazy. <laughs> For the majority, you know, a bunch of walking baits. You got chrome bone colors um some translucent ones kind of like this and just a big variety depending on you know Got if it's cloudy sunny outside whopper ploppers in whopper there. ploppers that's a killer night fishing bait right there Caught oh for plenty sure of toads on that but nice. you know, i'm not going to talk about everything i just kind of want to show you something. yeah i don't think we have time if we talked about every single box we may be here all night yeah, i don't know we, this isn't my main jerk bait box but this is some uh some nice. jerk baits i own my main jerk bait box has a ton of mega basses in there which yeah are quite expensive so this oh is, for sure this is you know one of those boxes get into these one of the couple of these big boxes oh you forgot one that's just more walking baits oh, top yes, water so cool. we just stack this up over here huh? at the end of the day like it's cool having all this tackle but you know without you guys supporting our channels you know we wouldn't be here let's take this one down big box number one so i like to keep my stuff assorted like i said depending on what lake i go to that was <laughs> that was smooth theory. these are all drop shot worms oh um you know i got a bunch of whack'em baits right here these are some older ones as you guys can tell some little drop shot baits. Um, these are little shad ones right here. Then you got some, you know, standard old worms. Ton of stuff. Let's go ahead and uh, let's get some of this stuff. I mean, I'm gonna we're gonna make. You yeah, know what? yeah, yeah, yeah. We're I think. A pile yeah, I think we need to make a pile. We're like, if pile, we see bro. something that we think is really cool and something that you don't mind parting with, I think we just oh, need dude. to start taking things and doing sure, one of these bro. numbers right here, like a little. For sure. Boop. So look right at that, there. You know, some more drop shot worms. These are robo worms. Some of the best drop shot worms out there that I've, you know, used. Oh, for um, sure. Heck, you know, three packs. Yeah, right you there. know, just toss a couple yeah. in the middle. I wonder um, what we're going to do with that stuff. Hmm. These, uh, I really don't know what this is. It's called a wild goby, but guess what? You know, goby in the middle. That. What else is this, man? That's a little ugly. I don't want to give you guys that, but dude, let's see. I'm telling you, we're going to be. That's a good bit of drop shots, drop shot, drop right, stop you know, stuff. We'll, we'll stop there, but anyways. I mean, who uses know? drop shots anyways? I mean, come on. Yeah. I've done it like twice yeah. in my entire yeah. life. That's first yeah. box right there. All right, going on the box two. Oh, box two weighs 400 pounds. Oh. All right, this one got a little mess. Got some worms. Wormy so, squirmies. More worms in here. As you guys know, I love my Sankos. I think Lojo loves his Sankos. Oh, no I think doubt. everybody loves their Sankos. So, yeah, this is all Sankos on this side. This is all shaky head worms. You know, like I said, oh, all assorted. And, um, yeah, man. That's whole a fat pack shazam. right there. Uh, 100 count. Morning dawn drop shot worms. Nice. Killer, killer for some big spotted bass. You wanna grab some stuff, Lord Jay? You wanna Dude, I I see this giant pack of Senkos right here. I mean, I think it's been used, but look, this is the seven inch. It, it, these are hard to find. The big Senkos. Oh yeah. That's crazy, man. Look at that. You got some uh, old yum dingers, you know, everybody loves the dingers. Let's just throw that. Yeah, put there. some dingers put in some there. Dingers in there. Um, got some havoc ones right there. Let's there you go. Put them in there. there. We got? got some of these. Yo, throw yeah, them big there. bite base. Right, we're just cool. getting. We're showing love to all the brands. You know what I mean? Like we we love everybody. All right. I think it's your turn, Lojo. Yeah, it's my turn to go. These boxes are pretty heavy, brother. <laughs> I've been going to the gym. I'm good. All right. All right. So kind of point me in the direction. So we went through the drop shot worms. Senko. Yep. So what is like the next category of big box? Crawls and lizards and stuff. That's pretty Ooh, cool. Yeah, you might want to pull yeah, that one out. Let's bust the old crawl and lizards because I don't. I am a fan of that kind of stuff. I'm gonna get a little closer to the pile right here. Go. Okay, so yeah, I think you were right. This is uh, like creature baits, like chunks and stuff like this. Killer. I mean, dude, I don't even like, this is so much, I don't even know. You didn't think, you didn't believe me when I said I really had a lot of tackle, did I, you? I, I don't, I wasn't prepared. Remember when I went to your house and you're like, Noah, I I, I think I got you beat here. Yeah, <laughs> so you no didn't realize, did you? Check these out. Check out these reaction innovation baits. The little the beavers. I love these things. I don't know if that's how all the claws look, like dipped in red, but oh, that's that's, killer. that's pretty freaking dope yeah. right there. Um, let's see. I saw some chunks earlier. Yeah, let's put those. Those are like some yeah. old school chunks. Good for jig trailers, stuff like that. I want some black and blue. I know you love the black and blue too. I just saw black and blue. Where did the heck did they go? Oh, there we go. Okay, a little triple ripple crawl trailer. Triple ripple trailer. Triple, triple, triple. triple ripple <laughs> crawl trailer. Black and blue. Throw them in there. Loves Dude, we already got. That freaking dude look at that man that's already over 10 packs of stuff we haven't even got through anything over here i know i want to get some baby brush hogs in there because that's one of that's an underrated that's an underrated thing for me oh that's a that's a lizard look at a lizard and some baby brush hogs there we go cool yeah let's uh let's see let's continue here so and these boxes are heavy dude what about these big boxes? Is there anything in here that's cool to look so, at? So these are a bunch of hard baits. You can pull them down, we can look. Um, like I said, man, I don't get to come hard to Atlanta baits. as much. Stuff in there. Hard baits are yeah. Oh my God. 
<laughs> Dude, look at this guy. Look, look at this. There's more of these tackle boxes just like this. Look, these are like little medium running. Dude, I wish I could grab things. some of these, but we can't ship them in like hooks. Yeah, you know that's good. But that'll catch them, man. Catch them. Okay, look at this right here, looks like. Look yep. at these bad boys. Those are all cedar. Every, each and oh, every one of them. Yeah, these are look. all wood. Look at that. Yep, that's actually what they look like. Unpainted. Yep. Dude, look at that. That is absolutely beautiful. I wouldn't even want to throw that right there. I just I would like keep that in a box <laughs> and not throw it. Look at this. We got more big freaking. Oh, that's wake stuff. baits, bro. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. oh where'd you look at the wakers. This boy been hiding the quakers. from me. This boy been hiding. We gotta move some him. more bullshit. We gotta move him at some point. Freaking, look at this. It's like a giant jerk bait. This is crazy, man. I have to say, I underestimated you, and I should not have done that. Dude, I'm putting this box back. There's just so. So much, it's like blowing my mind. <laughs> uh oh, got some little jig heads here of some kind. What is this? Like some just some straight up jig heads. Oh, those were the kicking their bass uh jig heads back in the day. No I, I made some, yeah. I used to make jigs, chatter baits, uh, really? spoons, wobble heads, shaky heads. Dude, I made the whole Shazam. Cool, I was all into it. This one is just like a just like another hodgepodge of like. Random stuff. Yeah, you gotta grab some stuff out of there, oh, Holmes. For sure, man. I'm trying to find something different that we haven't already kind of seen. Some big worms. These aren't labeled, but those are really cool. Yeah, you those are a plum, plum color. Yeah, if you want to, go for plum it. Plum color. It's like I something like that it. I got special made for a tournament. Like I, a, that's how. That's how a lot of my bags like they've just got a bunch of different. <laughs> you got a bunch of there. random stuff. Here we go. Some little. Oh yeah, little throw them in there. Pumpkin, little shaky head, little craw. Yeah. Oh, here we go. I have caught a couple fish off these things before. Oh, I was they? not a believer, but. Just for the heck. Nine pounder last year, bro, on the That's river. That's right. Yeah. You're, you're one of the people that I know that have caught big fish on those. Cool little box right there. Yeah, it's random, random so, stuff. So, I mean, let's take a break from tackle throwing because I am sweating like a it is bad. pig who's about to become bacon. Show us. Now, I know that you're not using a lot of this stuff anymore, but like, what is the deal with all the rods and reels that are sitting here? Because I know people notice them when we walk in. So, what's the deal with those bad boys? So, right here? this looks like a lot of Akuma stuff. Is that right? You for used, sure. You used to work with them? Yeah, I used to oh. work with. Uh... <laughs> oh god! Oh jeez! Low Joe. Got the little underspin on there though. Oh yeah, the fish head spin, dude. That's the you know it's my favorite bait oh, of all dude, time. Man. But yeah, man, I got a ton of different stuff. You know, I got a bunch of Akuma ones, um, a bunch of Saint Croix rods, a bunch of Abu reels. As you guys tell, I have a a winch right there. Ooh. Um, what else do I got? I got some Abu ones. I got some Akuma. I got um, these aren't all my rods, but you know, I got some Saint Croix. These are just stuff that you know yeah, I've, this is some I've had sitting stuff. around. Obviously, you're not using. And much then anymore. you know, I got a favorite one right there i got that one's rod brand right new yeah it's pretty cool it feels good yeah, it's a big sexy it's literally oh, called it is? It's literally called the big yeah, sexy, big sexy. <laughs> yeah. yeah we got to find some terminal tackle for our peeps too we got a lot of soft plastics here in a pile and we have nothing to rig them on so here we go now see. we talking you know this is some of the stuff that i don't use as much but these are some drop shot hooks right there. Because you got drop shot worms in we there. We got some, right? you know, three aught EWGs right here. This there is little go. offset hooks. You know what? Um, they're red, they're different, but guess what? Yeah, we'll throw go ahead and get there, some man. hooks in there, we'll throw man. Them in there. Here's some mustad drop shot hooks. There we go. Um, and those are killer, dude. These are some, you know, sharp hooks. Absolutely. I'll be I'll make sure to give you guys that since yeah, I've for sure. you know, some some stuff These in drop that. shot worms. Um, let's see what else we get. Here's some smaller drop shot hooks. We'll send those over there as well. Yeah, for sure. Gotta hook them up. Say, oh, this looks this, this looks promising. Where are we talking? You guys ready for this? Oh, dude, there's hard baits and packages. You guys ready oh, for this? Oh, right. hey, crankbait. Oh man, let's crank get it rolling. Fishhead dudes. Here's uh, Let me uh, see these crankbaits here. So you know we got standard. That one probably dies around 10 foot right there. Nice. Oh, eight, eight to 12. <laughs> oh, yeah, 10 foot. About 10 so. foot. Little sexy shad. Um, this one right here is actually called Ghost Shad. This is a killer crankbait as well, and this one's gonna dive around you know eight to ten foot. Mm -hmm. So that's, that's a good color. That color is awesome, yeah, man. I've caught a cool. ton of big fish on that. We'll throw that in there. Whoop. Also got some fish head dudes. You throw a little swim bait on the back of this thing. That is a fish catching machine. It's very underrated. You know we got a Livingston jerk bait. Oh man. Uh, more of like a natural shad color. We'll throw all those in yeah. as well. Yeah. Um, heck, I'll just throw those hooks in there as well. Yeah. Um, throw them in there. Ah. Uh, more drop. You know, let's throw them in there. Ooh, here we go. Now we're talking. We got some. Fish heads. These are there some we heavy go. ones. Underspins, baby. Um, got what a jig. Oh, a little jig. jig. Yeah, cool. Yeah, um, throw that in there. Let's see what else we got. Rattle trap. 
throw that in there. Yoink. I hope I didn't break that. <laughs> um, let's see. Pre-rigged drop shot. Oh, Amazing, man. bro. Since we got all the drop shot worms, we'll throw that in Absolutely. there. Absolutely. Um, deep diving crankbait, we'll throw that in Ooh, there. Another living um, Another jerk bait, we'll throw that in there. No. Nice. Let's see. Another uh, fish head dude, we'll throw that in oh, there. Oh, man. Um, spinner we're going bait, hard. Eagle, we'll throw that in there. We're going hard. Um, let's see. Alabama rig. Yes, a kit. Yes. That's a, it's called a boo teaser rig. Whatever. Oh, that that's uh, interesting. Crazy we'll, there. Oh, throw that in there. Um, here we go. Now we're talking. That's about the right size that we need. Yeah. Um, we'll go. throw that in there. And then we'll throw uh, this one in here, double nice, horse head. Nice, as well. nice, nice. And then some Gary Yamamoto Senkos. We cannot forget no, about that seven dollar pack those. right there. So Heck yeah, throw that in there. Got to show the support, man. There's an A rig right there that we'll throw in. Yoink. Um, we are uh, putting the term "big money" to shame right now. Right there, another crankbait, same one. We'll throw that in. Jerk bait, we'll throw that in. Dude, people are getting a jerk bait freaking clinic right now. All right, man. I think that's good right there <laughs> from, from that box. Woo, boy! We are getting uh, we're getting into some stuff right now, guys. We're 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 in it. We're in it to win it. I don't have the best. Oh right man! Now. You know this is. I, I need what this. They call this. Um, I need this so bad. What is this? Pooling buddy. Pooling buddy. Do they still make these? Um, yeah, I'm pretty positive they do. You know, we got a bunch of different fishing line. Got some seagar right here. That's about 12 pound. Um, bro, I need this in my life. Got some fishing line Ooh, right here. Ooh, got some fishing line. Some little strand mono. Hard to beat. Throw that in there. Ooh, hey. some sunscreen. Here we go. <laughs> Top Care Sport. You guys want this? Broad Spectrum SPF. It's only four years old. So, yeah, let's Here's not another pack, man. Ooh, Z -Man, uh, Z Baits. Or Z, Z Baits. Uh, Z Man Z Baits. I'm, I'm so tired right now. Uh, mud Beaver? Puppy. Mud it's called Puppy. A mud Puppy. It's like a little mud fish. Pretty cool. Cool. Look at that right there, man. Oh. Guys, I'm literally having to stop Noah yeah, right now. Shirt, Look, man. he's still looking. I, I, uh, What's that little shirt? <laughs> I'm having to stop him because he's put so much in this pile. I mean, I'm not a math whiz, but I'm gonna have to say that's at least a hundred dollars worth of. I mean, There's would some, you? Uh, Z bait sticks. We'll throw that. Would that be fair to say this is well over a hundred dollars worth oh, of well, stuff? Well I mean, with those with those jerk baits, crank baits. I mean, it may be even topping 150. Somebody who's a math whiz, look up all these baits <laughs> and can see how much this haul would be worth to you, the viewer, the very valued member of the Logia Fishing Fam. All right, Noah, that is it. That is it. I'm cutting you off. <laughs> this is so much stuff. Probably gonna cost like $20 to ship this stuff because the, the box that I put it in is gonna be so dang heavy. That is a freaking pile right there, guys. It's a variety too, man. I wish I had some weights, but rather than variety. That, you know, it's okay. I mean, we've got pretty much everything. You uh, got a shirt, you got a shirt, line. <laughs> hooks, line, all kinds of soft plastics, hard baits. There was a spinner bait that got put in there. Heck yeah. I mean, Name something that we forgot, honestly. Um, there's probably some things we forgot, but still. That's a pretty nice little haul right there. Ooh, we had to step outside. It's too hot. It's freaking it's too so hot, hot in there. Good Lord. It's literally 100, I mean, at least 100 degrees in there. Maybe more than that right now. It, it was a hot day today. Yeah, it's pretty bad. We've been filming all day, guys, so it's cool. it's freaking hot as heck. Still hot at night. That's how you know you're in the south, because it's still hot at night. So check it out, guys. Made this video for you guys, 100% for you. Not just my subscribers, but Noah's subscribers too. We know we have a lot of the same subscribers, that's because mm -hmm. we collaborate all the time but we want to continue that we want to continue to help have you guys help support our channels like i know you already do i mean i'm, I'm preaching to the choir but we do videos like this because a we know you guys love tackle i mean right your yeah, subscribers exactly. do too you guys love tackle you love like getting tours of the tackle truck now we got a tour of the tackle garage the I private place that really nobody's even really seen in a long time and we do this for you guys okay sure. so you want another tackle truck video but i think we outdid ourselves uh, by doing this i mean sure. this was crazy i didn't even know he had this until i came up to atlanta to visit him but uh yeah so you're probably wondering at this point how in the world can i win this stuff well much like the tackle truck video it's gonna be a little different than regular videos but not that much different so the first step is make sure you subscribe to my channel and that's the little red button right below the video it's free guys it takes two seconds and my analytics say like 60 percent 67 percent of my viewers are not subscribed to my channel so let's fix that let's get you guys subscribed doesn't Smash cost a thing, thing. next thing Go to Kicking Their Bass TV's channel. Subscribe to his channel. I'm gonna make it super easy. I'm gonna put a link right in the description. It's gonna say Kicking Their Bass TV. Click that link, go to his channel, subscribe to his channel. Once again, it's free. It takes about seven seconds to do that. The final step is to hit the thumbs up button, like this video. I know you guys like the video because you asked for it. And who doesn't like a giveaway? I mean, we if we if we could give you guys a giveaway in every single video, we would. We just don't want it to get old, you know what exactly. I mean? But we love giving back to you guys. It's not something that we do to get views or clicks. It's something we do because we want to reward you guys, right? I mean, we don't exactly. know any other way to reward you guys other than making the best content we can make 
and doing giveaways and trying to give you guys stuff back because we know we have a ton of stuff we're never going to use all of our stuff that we have we know some of you guys could really use it out there so we're trying our best to exactly. give back to you guys so exactly. subscribe to my channel subscribe to noah's channel like this video and you are entered guys that's all you have to do if you want a little bonus you can go follow me on instagram hit the bell but, you know, man. hit the hit bell the guys bell. Look. that should be a <laughs> no no that's a dang requirement it's, guys you you want to hit the bell what the bell does next to the subscribe button all it does is it lets youtube know that you want to get a email notification the next time i upload a video why is that important well because the winner of this giveaway will be announced in my exactly, next brother, video so you don't want to miss that guys you don't want to miss any of our uploads because we hide giveaways all the time that you might be missing if you miss an upload so enable the bell notification and whenever this video drops my next video go to the description of that video and you're going to see you know giant tackle garage giveaway winner and if you see your name get up with me it could be on instagram facebook snapchat twitter uh, gmail lojo.fishing at gmail.com all my social media is at lojo fishing i'm really easy to find and get up with i'll get the stuff sent right out to you but i think that's everything we are dying of heat stroke from today <laughs> filming and now being in that room for an hour so we are getting out of here guys on to the next fishing adventure fist bump we be out